Hi, this is Sir Marlon. Let us talk about effects of hormones in the body. Seminal processes in the body are coordinated by hormones which regulate and balance the working of organs, tissues, and cells. The endocrine system influences how your heart beats, how your bones and tissues develop, and even our capacity to have a baby. It plays an essential role in the occurrence of disorders such as diabetes, thyroid disease, growth disorders, and or sexual dysfunction. Both men and women produce hormones in the same areas with one exception, the reproductive glands. Additional male hormones are produced in testes, while female hormones are produced in the ovaries. Some hormones have short-term effects, while other hormones have long-term effects, such as those that control our growth and the changes of the onset of puberty. During puberty, there are many hormonal changes that happen in our body. One moment you laugh, and then suddenly you feel like crying. Sudden mood swings are relatively caused by the increasing amount of hormones in the body at this stage. It is therefore important to maintain a positive outlook in life and remember that these changes are only temporary and will stabilize with time. Hormones act in very small amounts. If the organs and hormones do not produce the regulated amount of chemicals to your body, it may result in an abnormality of your body. This condition is called hormonal imbalance. An increase or decrease in its amount may have a significant effect in the human body. The following are some examples of endocrine disorders. One is osteoporosis. It is a disease that happens when the mineral density of the bone is reduced making it brittle and porous. Parathyroid hormone secretion is one of the possible causes of this disease. The second one is goiter. It is an abnormal enlargement of the thyroid gland. It results from the underproduction or overproduction of thyroid hormones. Another one is gigantism. This is a disorder that happens during childhood when there is abnormal increase in height associated with too much secretion of growth hormones. We also have dwarfism. This is a condition wherein the production of growth hormones in the pituitary gland is insufficient resulting in short stature. If this is your first time watching my videos, make sure you hit the subscriber button. Thank you for watching.